Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we have a mother who is so tired of her fraudulent son's BS. She comes over to the traffic stop that he is at and chews him out. So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Would you mind identifying yourself, please? I'm definitely stuck. 410. 410, thank you. I appreciate you not doing that, but that could have went sideways for him. Because this, I fing a damn suspect, no damn crime. So there, no, 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 don't even. Because I don't give a shit, dude. You ever shit me like that again? It's going to take it as a immediate threat, and I'm going to deal with it accordingly. I ain't suspecting no goddamn crime. Yeah, you can't admit when you're wrong, can you? <laughs> and you can forget trying to fight me because I ain't, well, forget trying to, you can cite me, you can tick me. I ain't got to sign nothing. I ain't got to provide ID for it. <laughs> Touch me like that again. Wow, Frauditor, you're a big talker. And you're also a big cusser. But you know what? You know what I've found out over the years? The ones that are the biggest talkers are often the ones that can't back it up. I already had one of your deputies assault me. So do you really think that's smart? And this happened last what? Oh, bitch ass. Fucking rash homeless people. Hey, watch me come out of my fucking job. Ain't come around just fucking. Ain't commit no crime. Ain't impeding traffic the way he was claiming, making it out to be. I'm sitting here hugging this round, this line right here. Same thing. It's perfectly legal on that side. It's perfectly legal on this side with the conditions of this road. And for me to have to avoid potential danger because of it. Like I said, I've got the statute. For just that. Gotcha. I wasn't trying to be agitated, but I'm sorry, but when you just sit there and just reach up and you, I don't know what the you're doing, dude. It would have been no different. Is the F word all you can say? I mean, I'm getting tired of editing that out. Five hours later. Uh, are you mind hanging out over here while I talk to her for a second? I'm not going to have to, but yeah, I don't mind. You're a little more professional than this one. Look, get your reference. You ask somebody, can you disarm somebody? Okay? I have PTSD and I have autism. So you don't just reach at me, okay? I'm trying to help you out. I'm trying to help your department keep their officers. You're already gonna be losing enough officers as it is. Plus a sergeant. Oh, I'm so scared. Now, do you mind if I at least put it in my sheath Don't and put the sheath on the floor? So you gonna fucking threaten me? You just earned yourself a loss, you stupid. You're about to lose your. It was at this point I had to cut out a lot of material because the dude was just cussing up a storm. It was f bomb after f bomb after f bomb. But it comes down to this: the reason why he was cussing was because he wanted his property back which was a knife that was laying on the ground at their feet. But of course, since they're in the middle of a traffic stop, he's not supposed to have any weapons. Fucking stupid over here threatening me. You know, you came in this officer's car? Want to make fucking threats of violence against me? Unlawfully disarming me? Okay. <laughs> 
You know the only reason why you took it off of me is because I let you, stupid. You better start getting fucking through your head. You don't know what the fuck people's trained with. So you need to stop fucking just grabbing people. You ain't got no crime, you ain't got no jurisdiction. Next threat will be his on his fucking ass. So step away from my backpack. Because if you touch my fucking property again, I will defend it. Um, I got four jack in my car. I might try to jack it up real quick just to get the bike out. And I can get her on her way. <laughs> Guess what? You get back in that car, and I will go towards my knife, and you can't do nothing about it then. But don't ever fucking put your hands on me again. That's your first and your only fucking warning. Because if you ever go for my weapon, it'll be the last time you ever do. That's a fucking guarantee, son. Quit digging your hole deeper. And don't ever fucking touch me again. Stop. That's enough. That stupid I motherfucker don't fucking, fucking care. Stop. Shut the fuck up. Enough. I'll stop when his bitch ass quits stop his hand. Stop now. Enough. 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 Over here. I'm gonna listen. Come on, come on, come on. Still getting fucking illegal orders. I'm stopping right here. Kevin, get over here with me. He's good. I don't need your permission to be good. Shut up! All right, I'm tired of trying to edit everything out. It's gonna take all night to do so, and I don't have the time. I'm just gonna let his mother cuss him out from this point on because that's more entertaining than having to. And his words out. By all means, Mama, continue to chew your son out. I need you to come over here now. Enough. I'm here. Enough. Because you've got me shaking. Yeah, well, how do you think I feel? He fucking reached at my goddamn fucking knife for no fucking reason. Stop. Please. If he ever fucking does it again, I'll Damn. cut his fucking throat. That's enough. Please. Enough. Before you make me have to take a trip to Lakeview. Here I find out you're in the bed, and now you're fucking arguing. Just stop. I'm irritated because of his Damn. stupid action. Enough. Well, the video ends right there. Still pretty damn funny to watch a frauditor's mother chew him out after she gets tired of his BS.